all over. We did. It's really a, what's weird is how nice it was at the start of the game. It was really a beautiful night, and uh, if you love West Texas, it still is a beautiful night, I guess. And it's uh, guys did swing the bats good. Some balls found some holes again, and uh, but we had some really good at bats there at the start of the game, which is nice to see. He's just steady, isn't he? I mean, he's really he's a three pitch guy. He pitches on both sides of the plate and. You know what you're getting when he walks the mound. You know you're getting a strike thrower. Wasn't too many hearts beating too hard or too fast when he goes 3-0 on the first hitter. You know he's a strike thrower and always has been. And he's really steady in everything he does. Uh, they've been good. I've been seeing the ball well, and, and frankly, I think the whole team's been seeing the ball well. We've been putting up a lot of runs, putting up a lot of hits, and pitchers have been keeping them from doing the same thing. So everything seems to be working pretty well right now. Uh, it makes it a lot easier on me, knowing I just have to either bunt him over or just put the ball in play, give him to second base or whatnot. But Steven, he's been, he knows his own really well, and he's been swinging at good pitches and taking the tough ones. That carried us through the game. We didn't have very many uh, or really productive innings after that, but that got us up ahead and, and went through the game. <clears throat> yeah, I guess you could say that. We just come out with the, the same approach every game, you know, to have quality at bats and the pitching is going to be there. Usually defense is there too. So we just stick with the same approach. <clears throat> Should be fun. Um, Baylor just uh, won a very tough series and we're excited. We love good competition and I'm ready to see what we're made of. <clears throat>